Yo, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Diesel Senpai here, and today I'm going to show you how to remove Pokemon from your boxes, completely erase uh, entire boxes of Pokemon. Uh, that includes eggs as well, so if you've been cloning or if you've been shiny hunting, this will be helpful for you. So what we're going to do here, we're going to go for the fly storage glitch, and I have a new way of doing this. What we need to do here is you need to go on to hidden moves, like we normally do, right? Uh, you're going to move your analog stick over fly and you are going to spam R and ZR together until the map comes up. So I'm just going to spam here. Okay, so the map is up here and you need to do this next to a body of water. As you can see, I'm in Celestic Town. The next thing you're going to do here is gonna, you want to face the body of water. So I'm just going to press left here. So I'm facing the body of water. Just bear in mind, on your map, make sure that your cursor is not over any towns. So you can use your right analog stick here like so, and you can just move it away from the towns. The next thing you're going to do here is you're going to press A while facing the body of water, like so. And it's going to ask you if you want to surf. You're going to press A again, A again. And now, in the background, you can hear the animation for the surf activating. And now you can hear the surf music, right? So the next thing, once you're surfing, this uh, functions as the same thing that we did when we went into the Pokemon Center to activate the glitch and go down the stairs. This is doing the same thing. Now, to complete this part of the glitch, you need to actually come out of surfing. So we went left to enter the water here. I'm just going to press right. And you can hear the character jumped onto land now. So once you're on land, you can also hear that the surfing music has gone away. Now we're going to do the glitch like we normally do. So with my right analog stick here, I'm going to go over, say, Celestic Town again. Because maybe I want to fly there, whichever town you feel like, like I said. I'm going to press A, then X. So I'm, A is to get the fly uh, yes or no question up, and X is to bring the menu forward. So I'm going to go A, X, like so. I'm going to press A again to fly. And as you can see, we are now flying back to Celestic Town. Okay, so once you've completed flying, the next thing you need to do here is you need to get into a building. Any building is fine. The reason why we go into a building is because uh, we might uh, utilize the Y button for multi-select. And we don't want to press Y and then it opening up things like the Union Room or the Global Trading Room, things like that. Okay, so we are in the building now. We're going to go to Pokemon here. Yeah, I'm going to press A. I'm going to hit R for boxes. And uh, as you can see here, I have one, two, three, yeah, three boxes of Dittos, right? Uh, as you can see, box six is clear, box seven is clear, well, box eight has a Drapion, but that doesn't really matter. Okay, what you need now is you need a full box of Pokemon and you need an empty box. And essentially, we're going to try and get rid of box four and box five here. So the first thing you need to do is you're going to hit Y twice to get onto multi-select and you're going to select the first box here. As you can see, I have box three. Okay, cool. I'm going to hit A. It's going to pick the Pokemon up. I'm going to press R twice here to, sorry, thrice to, to move it over box six. Now box six, remember, is your empty box. The next thing you're going to do is you're going to hit X again. You're going to hit a onto Pokemon, you're going to open your boxes once again. Okay, so the box that we picked up was box 3. This is the Pokemon that's currently hovering in the air. So, let's try and get rid of box 4. How do we do that? We go into multi-select. You take the entire box 4 here. You pick them up as well. We move them onto box 6, where our previous Pokemon are hovering. We're going to say A, OK, and we're going to put them down. The next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to press B to go back, B to go back, B to go back. And this is bringing us to our previous hovering Pokemon on box 6. I'm going to press A here, and then I'm just going to go back so it resets. Then I'm going to press R to go back into the boxes. And now, if you look, box 6 is full, box 5 is full, but we have nothing in box 4 and box 3 because box 3's Pokemon was moved to box 6 and box 4 is deleted. And this is basically how you can repeat this process over and over with box 5, box 6. You'll basically only have one box full of Pokemon. 
and you can clear anything you can clear cloned pokemon uh pokemon that you were trying to shiny hunt even if you got eggs you want to get rid of this is how you can do it and uh, that's more or less the easy way that you can clear your boxes and the easy way to do the menu glitch as well so guys if you found this video helpful please smash that like button subscribe if you guys are new to the channel thank you so much for watching my videos take care and have an amazing day